I'm Rudy Williams and we begin with breaking news at five tonight. The state of Tennessee is now looking into the attempted foreclosure on Graceland. Yesterday, a judge ruled Elvis Presley's home was not for sale. The Tennessee Attorney General's office is looking into any misconduct in this case. Nassani Investments first staked claims to the deed to Graceland as a result of an alleged unpaid $3.8 million loan given to Lisa Marie Presley back in 2018. Well, Presley's granddaughter, actress Riley Keough, filed for a stay on the auction of Graceland. She alleges documents presented to the courts by Nassani are fraudulent. If there's fraud against uh, the Presley family, we need to make sure there aren't other families that are being affected similarly. If there's a scheme here that's being repeated throughout the state, we need to know about that and stop it. And, you know, they're just allegations. I want to emphasize that this is very early, but we're looking at it. Well, Tennessee AG Jonathan Scrimetti said it's unclear how long the investigation would take. However, he confirmed to ABC 24 that attorneys with his consumer team are in Memphis to start the investigation.